So, you thought dinosaurs were just big, scaly reptiles that roamed the Earth millions of years ago? Well, prepare for a reality check because recent discoveries have completely flipped the script on what we know about these ancient creatures. Scientists are now uncovering secrets that make even the most seasoned paleontologists do a double take. From bizarre body structures to unexpected behaviors, it's like watching a documentary where the plot twists faster than a T-Rex sprinting across a prehistoric plain. One of the biggest surprises came from a fossil found in Argentina, which revealed that some dinosaurs had feathers. Yes, you read that right. These weren't just fluffy little birds. They were full-fledged dinosaurs with feathers that helped them regulate body temperature or even fly. This discovery has led to a whole new debate about how dinosaurs evolved into birds, and honestly, it's making scientists rethink the entire evolutionary tree. Another mind-blowing find involved a dinosaur that could run faster than any known land animal. Imagine this, a creature with legs like a cheetah but built for power, capable of sprinting at speeds that would make Usain Bolt blush. This discovery was made through advanced computer modeling and analysis of fossilized footprints, which allowed scientists to estimate the speed these dinosaurs could achieve. It's like finding out your favorite superhero has superhuman abilities you never knew about. But wait, there's more. Researchers have also discovered that some dinosaurs were surprisingly social creatures. Fossils found in groups suggest that certain species live together in herds, much like modern-day elephants or wildebeests. This behavior was previously thought to be exclusive to mammals and birds. So the idea that dinosaurs had complex social structures is both fascinating and a bit unsettling for those who imagine them as solitary beasts. And let's not forget about the color of these ancient giants. Using microscopic analysis of fossilized feathers, scientists have managed to determine the colors of some dinosaur species. Imagine seeing a rainbow of hues on a velociraptor or a vibrant green T-Rex. This is like finding out your favorite cartoon character has a secret identity as a superhero with a colorful costume. Imagine stumbling upon a creature so bizarre it makes your head spin. This is exactly what happened when paleontologists uncovered new dinosaur species that defy everything we thought we knew. These discoveries aren't just about finding bones. They're like opening a time capsule filled with surprises, each one more jaw-dropping than the last. One of these dinosaurs had a tail so long it could have doubled as a snorkel, allowing it to breathe while swimming through ancient seas, a feature that completely upended our understanding of how these creatures moved and lived. Another find was a dinosaur that looked like a cross between a chicken and a crocodile, complete with a beak and scales. Scientists were left scratching their heads because this creature didn't fit neatly into any existing category. It wasn't just the physical traits that shocked them. It was how this species evolved in such an unexpected way. Instead of following the typical path of dinosaur evolution, it took a detour that made scientists rethink the entire timeline of life on Earth. What really adds to the excitement is that these new species were found in places where no one expected them. Think about it. Dinosaurs are usually associated with vast deserts or lush forests, but some of these discoveries came from unexpected locations like remote islands or deep within dense jungles. These environments provided unique conditions that allowed these dinosaurs to thrive in ways we never imagined proving that nature is full of surprises and that our understanding of the past is still evolving. One of the most mind-blowing finds was a dinosaur with feathers that looked more like a modern bird than a prehistoric beast. This discovery challenged the long-held belief that all dinosaurs were scaly and reptilian. Instead, it suggested that some dinosaurs had evolved into feathered creatures much earlier than previously thought, blurring the line between dinosaurs and birds. It's like finding out your favorite superhero has a secret identity that you never knew about, Totally unexpected, but completely fascinating. These new species aren't just changing our textbooks. They're rewriting the story of evolution itself. Each discovery adds another piece to the puzzle, helping scientists piece together how life on Earth developed over millions of years. It's like solving a mystery where every clue leads to a bigger picture. And sometimes that picture is more complex than we ever imagined. Okay, so you thought dinosaurs were all alone in the wild, right? Well, think again. Recent fossil discoveries have flipped the script on what we used to believe about these ancient creatures. Turns out, some dinosaurs weren't just running around by themselves, they were actually part of a social group. Imagine if your favorite dinosaur was like a member of a football team or a family unit, hanging out with others for fun and survival. Scientists have found evidence that certain species of dinosaurs lived in groups, much like how modern animals such as wolves, elephants, or even some birds live together. These findings come from fossilized remains that were discovered close to each other, suggesting they might have been part of a herd or family unit. It's like finding a bunch of dinosaur skeletons all sitting around a campfire, sharing stories and maybe even playing games. But wait, how do we know they weren't just randomly buried together? 
Well, the key lies in how these fossils were arranged. Some of them show signs of injuries that would have been healed if they lived in groups, which means they probably had friends to help them recover. Plus, there are even some fossilized nests with multiple eggs, hinting at parental care and maybe even babysitting among dinosaurs. Who knew T-Rexes had a supportive community? Another fascinating clue comes from the way certain dinosaur species behaved. For example, some fossils show that they might have engaged in activities similar to those of modern animals, like herding or protecting their young. This kind of behavior suggests a level of intelligence and social interaction that was previously thought impossible for dinosaurs. It's like discovering that your favorite dinosaur had a best friend who always knew where the snacks were. So, what does this mean for our understanding of dinosaurs? Well, it means we're not just looking at these creatures as mindless beasts running around in the prehistoric wilderness. Instead, they might have been complex beings with social structures, communication methods, and even emotional connections. It's like finding out that your favorite dinosaur had a personality. Maybe even a bit of a drama queen when things got tough. Okay, so you thought dinosaurs were just big, lumbering creatures that roamed the earth and then vanished? Well, think again. Recent studies have revealed some truly jaw-dropping behaviors that make us question everything we thought we knew about these ancient beasts. For starters, imagine a dinosaur mom carefully laying eggs in a nest, not just tossing them haphazardly into a pile like you might do with your kids' toys. Scientists now believe some dinosaurs, like the Oviraptor, actually built nests and even sat on their eggs to keep them warm, kind of like a modern-day chicken or duck. This level of parental care is way more advanced than we ever imagined for these prehistoric giants. But wait, there's more. Some dinosaurs were probably pretty good at keeping their young safe. Researchers have found fossilized nests with baby dinosaur bones still inside, suggesting that parents might have stayed around to protect their offspring. It's like finding a family photo album from the Mesozoic era. Except instead of people, it's full of tiny, adorable little dinosaurs. These findings are shaking up the scientific community because they show that some dinosaurs had complex social structures and even emotional bonds with their young, which is pretty wild to think about when you picture them as mindless monsters. Now, here's a twist that might make your head spin. Some dinosaurs could have communicated with each other in ways we never expected. Recent studies suggest that certain species, like the hadrosaurs, those duck-billed dinosaurs, might have used vocalizations similar to birds or even whales. Imagine hearing a low rumble echoing through the forest as a herd of hadrosaurs moved together, like a prehistoric version of a marching band. This kind of communication would have been essential for coordinating group movements, warning each other of danger, and maybe even forming social bonds. It's like they were having conversations in their own unique dinosaur language. And let's not forget about the nesting habits themselves. Some dinosaurs built nests that were surprisingly sophisticated, Think of them as prehistoric birdhouses with multiple chambers or even structures that could hold dozens of eggs. These nests weren't just random piles of dirt and sticks. They were carefully constructed, sometimes even in locations that protected the eggs from predators or extreme weather. It's like these dinosaurs had a deep understanding of their environment and how to create safe spaces for their young, kind of like modern day architects, but with a lot more teeth. So what does all this mean? Well, it means that dinosaurs were way more complex than we ever gave them credit for. They weren't just mindless beasts running around eating plants or chasing each other. They had families, they communicated, and they even built homes. These discoveries are changing the way scientists view these ancient creatures. And honestly, it's making us rethink how intelligent life can be in any era. Who knows what else we'll find next? Maybe dinosaurs were just as clever as we are, just with a lot more feathers and less fashion sense. Did you know that scientists are now discovering that dinosaurs weren't just roaming around in dusty deserts or swampy jungles? No, no, no. They were actually living in a whole bunch of different environments, some of which might surprise you. For example, new research has shown that some dinosaur species thrived in lush, tropical forests with high humidity and plenty of vegetation. Imagine walking through a prehistoric rainforest where trees towered over the ground like skyscrapers and dinosaurs were busy munching on leaves and fruits. It's like they had their own version of a buffet. But wait, there's more. Scientists have also found evidence that some dinosaurs lived in colder climates which is pretty wild considering how we usually picture them as scaly, sunbathing creatures. Fossils discovered in regions with harsh winters suggest that certain dinosaur species were adapted to survive in chilly environments. Think of it like a prehistoric version of polar bears or penguins. These dinosaurs had special features, like thick fur or feathers, that helped them stay warm and cozy during the cold months. It's like they had their own winter gear. Oh, and here's something even more shocking. Some dinosaur fossils have been found in places where there was a lot of volcanic activity. 
that means these ancient creatures might have lived near active volcanoes or in areas with frequent earthquakes. Picture this. Dinosaurs walking through a landscape that looked like it was from a sci-fi movie, with lava flows and ash clouds in the sky. It's like they were living on a planet where nature was constantly changing and evolving, just like our world today. These new discoveries are helping scientists understand how dinosaurs interacted with their environments and how climate change affected them back then. For instance, some studies suggest that changes in temperature and rainfall patterns might have played a role in the extinction of certain dinosaur species. It's like they were dealing with a version of global warming long before humans even existed. By studying these ancient ecosystems, scientists can learn more about how life adapts to environmental shifts, which is super important for understanding our own planet's future. So next time you think about dinosaurs, don't just picture them in the same old setting. They were part of a dynamic and ever-changing world, with environments that ranged from swamps to forests to icy tundras. These findings are not only fascinating but also crucial for understanding how life on Earth has evolved over millions of years. Who knew studying ancient creatures could help us predict what's happening today? It's like time travel without the need for a DeLorean.